Good morning. How are you? Happy, happy Friday. Yes. Each time I get a chance to be off, I enjoy it. And of course, I'm on my balcony. It actually feel like I'm at some type of resort. <laughs> Picture that. I'm actually looking at a parking lot. But anyway, hey, thank God for a roof over my head, food to eat, health and strength. My God, can't ask for nothing better. I mean, the traveling mercy, when we decide we want to go this way, that way, you know, school is back in. We have to be very careful. We have to make sure that we stop at the bus stops for the kids crossing the street. There's so many things going on, and we have to be more attentive. We really do. You know, we're not exempt, but things do occur, and we just need to ask for God's direction in the right mind, because it's easy to slip. Each day, God give us brand new mercies over and over and over again. And as he know my desire to transition, he already know the path will be so, so hard when it should be easy. And we know the devil already trying to win all the souls he can. But either way, God, but God, <laughs> But I just want to say good morning. Those who are on my Facebook, thank you. And I'm just having a good morning. I have my alarm clock with me, as you can see here. Rocky. He's up. Yes, my alarm clock. <laughs> so we basking in the sunshine. And he's trying to obviously tell me something. But either way, I just want everybody to say hello to anyone you come across. It can be hard sometimes because you don't speak to me. I ain't speaking to her. I ain't speaking to him. I don't know that dude. We know how it is, the natural feel. But sometimes some people just not in the mood to have a good day. And I understand that. They say different strokes for different folks, which is a true statement. And if you don't have a peace of mind, then we already know it can go downhill at any time. So I ask God when I pray for forgiveness. And anytime I've come across anyone, anywhere, if it has not been a Christ-like, then I apologize. And I ask for forgiveness. Because overall, I'm a versatile, natural, genuine spirit type of lady. Everybody I've met along the way know this. But it comes a time in your life, you have to say, forgive me, I am sorry. Because it may seem like you're thorough at that moment, but really, it's tearing you to pieces if you don't fix it. So within your heart, you have to find a way to just say, I'm sorry. It doesn't matter if they don't like you anymore. As long as you did what you're supposed to do. And it's like a weight lifted off your shoulder when you just woman up, man up, and say, I'm sorry, or my bad.